I want to thank you guys. I want to thank Sissy and Queen Taco for having me. Thank you very much. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Josh Crocker. I plan on being your future city councilman in Independence, Missouri. in a couple ways. A, after you hear what I have to say about what I want with the city, tell your friends, tell your family, have them tell their friends and their family. Word of mouth is the best advertisement there is. And I will tell you this, I won't let you down at all. I promise you that. You hear that a lot from a lot of politicians. But I come from a strong family root with a strong friend that won't let me let you guys down. Let me tell you guys a little bit of what I'm about. I feel like independence can take care of four simple things. A, safety and security. Our citizens and our uh, businesses here in independence want to be able to feel safe. They want to be able to know that the response time, if you have your house broken into, is going to be three minutes, two minutes, less than that. Not 10 to 12 minutes. If your house is on fire and you're asleep in your house, you want to know that you're going to have a fire truck there beating on your door before the flames and the smoke take care of you and your family. I feel strong about that. Safety and security of my citizens, my neighbors, you all are my neighbors. And now you're my family. The second part I think we need to take care of is rebuilding companies, rebuilding the main tax corridors, taking care of 23rd Street, Nolan Road, Truman, 24 Highway. These corridors are very, very important. Fill them with companies and, and businesses like this place here. Unique shops that perform and do a unique business and a unique service. Places that aren't all were already here. Places that you don't see on every block. Like payday loan places. Bring more businesses in here. I think I can help do that by getting in touch and actively and aggressively reaching out to other places. Just for an example, ponchos. <laughs> That's right. What's a ponchos? All you can eat Mexican is well fit. <laughs> All right. Probably not the right time to say that. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> That's direct competition. The third thing that I think we need to do is we need to actively take care of our community. That starts with you, 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 and you. Go home. Meet your neighbors because I know there's neighbors you don't know. Understand a few things. That neighbor is not exactly like you. It does not have the same values as you. But if somebody's breaking into your house, boy, you want that person right there next to you. You want them to call the police first. You want them to take care of things. I believe that we can actively, before we're able to put police onto the streets, I think that we can get more of a community involvement, more of a community policing, and take back our neighborhoods. I also believe strongly in my education. Independent School District was at one time the best school district in the state of Missouri. We were able to bring people from all over that would flock here and move here just to go to schools at our schools. Now we have people running and that scares me. What we can do is tie all four of these together that are going to help out. You get safety and security, your businesses are going to pop up. And you're going to have more families come into the neighborhood. That happens, your sales tax corridors fill up. And that's where our teachers get paid for. You take pride in your community, your property value is going to rise. I believe in this, and I believe in you guys. That's why you're here right now. Before I get done, I want to let you know a couple things. I do not quit. I do not start something and back out. 
I do not fall with pressure. You cannot come up to me and say it's not going to be good for you. Walk away. That will never happen. I'm here until you vote me in or you vote me out. Either or. Hopefully you vote me in. I believe it's time to change. You're going to hear a lot about this here. Josh Crocker for change. Independence needs change. All the way through, when I'm going through this, for the next seven months, you're going to hear change. Embrace change. People are afraid of change. People are afraid of doing something different. People are afraid of trying something outside the box. Don't fear change. If you're scared, the enemy wins. Every time. You never progress. This city, I love my city. I have passion for my city, and I know my city can grow better than what it is. We've already achieved good things. Now it's time to achieve greatness. One last thing is, is I'm going to let you know one thing. A wildfire starts with a spark. Let me be that spark.